In a dimly lit room filled with mystical artifacts, a young woman named Maya uncovers a mysterious talisman. This is no ordinary trinket. It's a relic from the past, steeped in the secrets of the ages, hidden in the forgotten corner of her late grandfather's attic. It's as if this enchanting object was waiting, biding its time, waiting for the right hands to hold it once more. As Maya's fingers gingerly caress the talisman, she feels an unusual surge of energy. The room seems to breathe, shrouded in an ethereal glow. Suddenly a voice, as old as time itself, echoes through the room, wrapping around Maya like a gentle breeze. It's a voice from the talisman, a voice from the past, a voice that bears the weight of an ancient prophecy. The voice speaks, its words painting vivid images in Maya's mind. It weaves a tale of power, destiny, and balance. It speaks of a prophecy foretold in sacred texts, an ancient prediction about a chosen one. This chosen one is destined to rise, destined to restore balance to a world teetering on the brink of chaos. The talisman, the voice reveals, is the key. The key to power, the key to destiny, the key to balance. Maya, our young protagonist, finds herself at the heart of this prophecy. Is she the chosen one? Could she be the beacon of hope in a world veering towards imbalance? The talisman in her hand seems to hum in response, its energy resonating with her own. But prophecies are cryptic, their words often shrouded in mystery. Unlocking this mystery won't be an easy task. It will take courage, resilience, and a burning desire to uncover the truth. Yet, Maya feels an undeniable pull, a call to action, a call to destiny. Intrigued, Maya embarks on a quest to unlock the talisman's power and fulfill the prophecy. She knows her journey will be fraught with trials and tribulations, but she is ready. For in her heart, she feels a spark. A spark ignited by the possibility of what could be, what should be, what will be. Maya's journey takes her across diverse landscapes, each presenting its own unique trials. From the bustling bazaars of the Middle East to the serene Zen gardens of Japan, the icy tundra of the Arctic to the deep heart of the Amazon rainforest, each location unfolds a new chapter, a new challenge in Maya's quest. In the arid deserts, she encounters the nomadic tribes who teach her the art of survival, of enduring the harshness of nature. They show her that the talisman's power isn't just about brute force, but resilience and persistence. Yet the desert isn't forgiving. It tests her endurance, her resolve, pushing her to the brink. But Maya perseveres, harnessing the talisman's power to withstand the scorching sun and chilling nights. Next, she ventures into the lush greenery of the Amazon. Here she meets the indigenous tribes, guardians of the forest, who show her the talisman's connection to nature, to life itself. But the forest is a maze, a web of life and death. Maya faces dangerous predators, venomous creatures lurking in the shadows. But with the talisman, she learns to coexist, to respect the balance of nature, turning adversaries into allies. Her journey then takes her to the Arctic, a world of ice and snow. The Inuit people, masters of the cold, teach her the power of adaptation, of change. The trials here are harsh, unforgiving. Sub-zero temperatures, blizzards, treacherous ice fields. But Maya adapts, using the talisman's power to overcome the cold, to navigate the icy wilderness. Finally, she arrives in Japan, a land of tradition and tranquility. The monks, masters of inner peace, show her the talisman's potential for inner balance, for harmony. But the journey here is one of self-discovery, a trial of the mind and spirit. Maya faces her own fears, her doubts, her past. With the talisman, she finds her inner peace, her balance, completing the final trial. Throughout her journey, Maya meets powerful beings, ancient guardians, each holding a piece of the talisman's mystery. She faces formidable adversaries, forces seeking to prevent her quest. But with every trial, every challenge, Maya grows. She learns to harness the talisman's powers to understand its true nature, from survival in the desert to balance in the forest, adaptation in the Arctic, and inner peace in Japan, the talisman's powers are as diverse as the cultures Maya encounters. Each trial, each lesson shapes Maya, molds her into the chosen one, the guardian of the talisman. The talisman's power isn't just about controlling elements, but understanding them, respecting them, becoming one with them. Every trial faced serves as a lesson, 
each encounter a step closer to understanding the talisman's true potential. The journey is far from over, but Maya is ready. She's no longer just a young woman on a quest, but a guardian, a protector, ready to face whatever lies ahead. As the final destination draws near, a dark figure emerges from the shadows. A confrontation is imminent. Maya, our young protagonist, stands face to face with a sorcerer, a man consumed by a hunger for power and domination. His eyes, burning with greed, are set on the talisman Maya carries. He seeks to exploit this enchanted artifact for his own gain, oblivious to the catastrophic consequences it could unleash. But Maya is no longer the innocent girl who stumbled upon a mysterious talisman in her grandfather's attic. She's a warrior, a chosen one, a beacon of hope. Throughout her journey, she's faced various trials and tribulations, each one strengthening her resolve and teaching her to harness the power within the talisman. She has learned to navigate treacherous terrains, outsmart powerful beings, and stand her ground against menacing adversaries. Now, she must use all her wits and strength to protect the talisman. She understands its power, its potential, and the balance it can bring to the world. She also knows the devastation it can cause if it falls into the wrong hands. The sorcerer, underestimating Maya's determination and courage, lunges towards her, hoping to snatch the talisman. But Maya is ready. She draws upon the talisman's power, summoning a force field that sends the sorcerer reeling backwards. Undeterred, the sorcerer strikes back, but Maya, fueled by her unwavering spirit and the talisman's strength, counters each attack. The room echoes with the clash of power and will, the air crackling with tension. This isn't just a battle for the talisman, it's a battle for the fate of the world. Maya knows she can't afford to lose. With a final surge of energy, she overpowers the sorcerer, sending him sprawling to the ground, defeated and powerless. With the sorcerer defeated, the talisman's power is safe from misuse. Maya stands victorious the fate of the world secure in her hands. But her journey is far from over. There are still revelations to be made, truths to be uncovered and a legacy to be reclaimed. Overcoming the sorcerer reveals an unexpected truth. As Maya stands victorious, a ripple of energy pulses from the talisman illuminating the room with a soft, ethereal glow. The air fills with a sense of peace, a stark contrast to the tension that hung heavily just moments before. Suddenly, the talisman begins to hum, vibrating with an energy that seems to beckon Maya closer. As she reaches out, a vision unfolds before her. She sees a group of people, their faces kind and familiar, their hands holding the very talisman she now possesses. With a start, she realizes that these are her ancestors, her long lost family. Her heart pounds as she learns that they were the protectors of the enchanted world charged with the responsibility of maintaining balance and peace. They were the guardians of the talisman, the keepers of its power, the very same power that now courses through her veins, intertwining with her destiny. The vision shifts, revealing scenes of her family standing against dark forces, using the talisman to restore order. She sees their strength, their resilience, and the unwavering belief they held in their mission. As the vision fades, Maya is left with a profound sense of understanding. Her journey, her trials were not random events, but part of a greater purpose. She is a descendant of the protectors, the chosen one prophesied to carry forward the legacy. The talisman had not simply chosen her, it had come home. Home to its rightful protector, home to where it belonged. This revelation brings with it a sense of purpose and clarity that Maya had never experienced before. The reality of her heritage sinks in, and with it comes a wave of responsibility. She is now the guardian of the enchanted world, the protector of the talisman. This is her destiny, her legacy, and her mission. But with this newfound knowledge comes a sense of acceptance. Despite the weight of her responsibilities, Maya feels a surge of determination. She has faced trials and tribulations, overcome adversaries, and learned to harness the power within the talisman. She has proven herself worthy of her lineage, of the legacy passed down to her. Maya, now aware of her lineage, accepts her role as the talisman's protector. She embraces her destiny, ready to carry forward the mission of her ancestors. 
She is no longer just Maya, the curious young woman who stumbled upon a mysterious talisman. She is Maya, the chosen one, the protector of the enchanted world, the guardian of the talisman. She has accepted her destiny, ready to face whatever challenges lie ahead, for she knows she is part of a greater legacy. A legacy of protectors, a legacy of power and balance. And with the talisman by her side, she is ready to uphold this legacy. To protect and serve, to restore and maintain balance in the enchanted world. With balance restored, Maya returns home, forever changed by her journey. A journey that led her through uncharted territories and against formidable foes all in the name of a prophecy. A prophecy she'd uncovered in the quiet solitude of her late grandfather's attic, hidden within the mystical aura of an enchanted talisman. She reflects on the many trials she had to face, each one a riddle wrapped in the culture and lore of far-flung lands. She was tested, time and again, pushing the boundaries of her strength and resolve. Yet she persevered, driven by a cause greater than herself, and with each challenge overcome, she felt the talisman's power grow, pulsating in harmony with her heartbeat, as if they were one. The confrontation with the sorcerer, a villain masked in deceit and hunger for power, was a battle of wits and courage. She'd stood her ground, her spirit unbroken, using the talisman's power to prevail. That victory was not just hers. It was a victory for the balance of the world a triumph over the forces that sought to exploit its magic. With the sorcerer defeated, Maya discovered the truth of her lineage, a revelation that resonated deep within her soul. She was not an ordinary woman who'd stumbled upon an enchanted artifact. She was the rightful heir, the guardian of an enchanted world. This truth brought with it a profound sense of purpose, a purpose that was larger than her, larger than the trials she'd faced. It was a legacy she was honored to uphold. Yet, with this newfound sense of purpose came responsibility. The responsibility to protect the enchanted world, to ensure the talisman's power is never misused. It was a daunting task, but one she was ready to embrace. She was, after all, the chosen one, the one destined to restore balance. As Maya gazes at the talisman, she smiles, ready to embrace her destiny as the protector of the enchanted world. There's a spark in her eyes, a glint of resolve, as she steps into this new chapter of her life, forever bound by the enchantment of the talisman.